Yesterday, we celebrated the Feast of the Presentation of Jesus, which is also known as Candlemas Day, because the candles that are used in our worship are traditionally blessed then. And today, a day when we honor an early church martyr named Blaze, we take some of those candles and use them to bless throats. Hello, I'm Father James Kabicki, and I suspect you're familiar with the story behind this tradition. At one point in the Holy Bishop Blaze's life, some say while he was being hauled off to prison, a woman came running up to him, imploring his help. Her son was choking on a fishbone that was lodged in his throat. Bishop Blaze answered her plea, stopped, and offered a prayer for the boy, and he was immediately cured. As a result, the tradition developed of blessing throats on his feast day with the newly blessed candles from the Feast of the Presentation. While it might seem odd to have a day on which we bless throats, and not one for blessing backs, knees, hearts, stomachs, the blessing prayer that's used actually covers all those bases as well. Obviously, God is concerned about more than just our throats. He's concerned about all of us, our entire body, and especially our soul. But why doesn't God show that concern by healing us every time we ask? That's a mystery. And all we can say is that, looking at the big picture, God must have some reason for saying no to our requests, just the way he said no to his son when he prayed in the Garden of Gethsemane. But let's not give up praying, and let's pray that St. Blaise blessing prayer right now. Through the intercession of St. Blaise, bishop and martyr, May God deliver you from ailments of the throat and from every other evil. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.